Hey everybody, Derek Allen here, and I would like to thank you for checking out my WSO. And boy, have I got a treat for you today. Finally, a plugin that is designed for offline marketers that is actually useful. It's a crazy concept, but hear me out. I won't take up too much of your time. Okay, so I came up with this plugin. By researching this thing right here, it's called Basecamp, it's what you see on your screen. It's a project management um, type of thing where you can go online and collaborate with other people, keep people in the loop of their projects. I thought, well, that's a great idea. I would really like to implement this and put this into my offline business to keep my, my clients in the loop about how their projects are going, right? Which only makes sense, right? Because, you know, whenever you give someone money, to perform a service for you and it's been you know a couple days or something like that then you kinda want a status update it's no different with your clients because they give you the money and they want to know how things are going plus if you're anything like me you probably got into the internet marketing thing because the income potential is great and you can sit in your pajamas all day long and work from home and not have to deal with people but if you get into the offline marketing thing unfortunately you're going to have to talk with people at some point. But this plugin that I've created for you minimizes that as much as possible so that you can just focus on what you have to do, manage your outsource team, manage your staff, or actually complete the work yourself. So it's really great. So I was looking at this base camp thing, and I thought, well, let's give this a shot. So I went to see plans and pricing, and then I noticed right here, $99 a month. For 100 projects, 30 gigs worth of storage, unlimited users. I thought, well, that's great. Um, and then I looked over here at this $49 a month plan. And this one right here wasn't really going to work with, for me. So I had to go to this $99 a month thing. And then I got to thinking, that would just be another expense in my business when I could just have this thing developed for a couple, 300 bucks or so, and have my own, right? So that's exactly what I did. And so... In this video, I just want to give you a quick demo of what I've had created. All right, so here we are at the demo page. You can see this page yourself if you scroll down the thread a little bit. Um, there's an option for you to click the link and then visit this page. All right, this is exactly what your client would see. Obviously, this design right here would be whatever WordPress theme or WordPress design that you have. Okay, it wouldn't look just like this. This is, again, just the demo page. So your client visits your page and they come right over here to the client login area. Now you will create them an account manually and pass on the login credentials to them. So they would use whatever login credentials you gave them. What they're gonna see over here it says welcome and then it'll state their name automatically that you created for them um, for their account. It'll say you can view your project updates at the progress page. They can click this link and it'll take them right here. Okay, now this first section is sort of like a welcome. Whatever you want in this section, you know, let them know how to use this page, what to expect. You can even put uh, project updates right here. You can put in your contact information, whatever you want. Personalize it, make them feel, you know, special, I guess you could say. And then down here, you have the status of the current project. And this is just a little uh, progress bar and the green obviously represents work completed the red represents the work that's remaining also has a little percentage type of deal right here 30 percent completed um, you change all that in your back office then you have the scope of work box now as you can see in this box basically you just write down you know whatever you and your client agreed upon in the contract so whatever work that you guys agreed upon you just write it right here and what's great about this is if you put something in this box and the client comes and visits this and they see it and something looks a little bit fishy, maybe it's something they didn't really understand or agree on, they can contact you immediately. And what that'll do is that'll save you from investing any kind of money or time or effort into actually going ahead with the, uh, the project. And avoiding mistakes is great because, like I said, that's a huge time saver. And it makes both you and your client very happy to know that your client won't have to spend any more money uh, because you misunderstood something or vice versa. Okay, so you would just put the scope of work right in here. The work completed, pretty self-explanatory. 
every time you nail out a new task. You bang it out, it's done, you just write it right here. So this will allow your client to come and look and say, okay, so this was done, this was done, this is done, that's great. Things are getting done and I like that. It'll impress the heck out of your clients, believe me. Work remaining. Obviously, this is, again, pretty self-explanatory. You just write down in here the work that is still left to do according to your scope of work, okay? So that way your client will know exactly what's left to do and how long it'll be until their project is completely finished, they're live on the internet, and they're getting leads, new customers, branding, exposure, whatever you're set out to do for them. The payment agreement. Now this is just here to protect you and your client. The payment agreement just basically lists what the contract says. So $497 setup fee, that's the payment agreement that's paid in full. But now we have, let's just say your client's on a monthly recurring basis. You'll specify that. There's also an option to say it's paid in full. And then the due date, you can specify a due date for the next payment or specifically when your client can expect an invoice. Um, also, the payment remaining, and that could be, you know, whatever you specify per month. So $97 each month for maintenance fees. Okay. And then down here, this is just a contact box. If they have a question or concern, you want to encourage them to send you an email. And then you can talk about it, whatever the problem is. This is a very neat plugin. It will allow you to interact with your clients and allow them to interact with you without you actually having to do anything. And this is going to build huge trust with your client, it's going to lead to them passing your name around. It's going to lead to them allowing you to do more long-term business for them and with them. That is the uh, the front end. That's what the client sees. Now, let me go ahead and show you the back end real quick. As you can see, you would just upload this plugin just like you would any other plugin. And once you've done that and it's activated, what you're going to get is this nifty little sidebar icon thing that says touch base. Now. If you click that, it'll have a drop down menu where you can add project progress for your clients, edit project progress, client payments, and settings. Okay, add project progress, pretty simple. You select the client name through your list right here, then you have the scope of work, work completed, work remaining. And you can enter the information and then you can edit this stuff with the full text editor right here that's built into the plugin. You can do that for all three of those. Uh, boxes and now the project progress enter in a number of how far along you think the project is so let's just say it's 30 percent you do that save progress then to edit the progress it's pretty simple just come over here to the client there'll be several here and then edit now client payments client name again you select it Payment agreement, amount paid in full. If it is paid in full, you'd select that option. If it's monthly or recurring, you can do that. Enter all that information in there. And then the settings. This is where you would put in your uh, personal welcome message. And then also it does come with a widget, a login widget, which you would just drag there, which will allow your clients to log into your site. So as you can see, this plugin makes a heck of a whole lot of sense. If you run an offline consulting business or even a service-based business where you perform uh, web design, backlinking, whatever the case may be, this is a plugin that you need to add to your arsenal. Your clients will appreciate it. It will save you a lot of time. It will keep you organized. And overall, it's going to get you more business because you are a professional. And it will really set you apart from the rest of your competition because no one else is offering this option to their clients. So I want to invite you to get in on the beta release for this plugin. Click the buy button below. One low one-time fee. You're in it. You're also going to get free updates for life and we have some serious, serious updates planned. We're releasing this plugin now just so we can kind of get some initial feedback. But keep in mind, once these new features are added, we're pulling this off of the WSO board back and we're going to offer this for $97. We intend on making this one of the best client management solutions on the internet today. So get in while you can. That's it for me. I'm Derek Allen. I'll see you on the other side.